Episode 22, Parenting, Comedy Routines Being a parent and raising kids, huh? That's a topic that's sure to hit home for many of us in the audience tonight. Let me start by saying that being a parent is a full-time job, and it's not for the faint of heart. You have to be on your toes at all times, constantly on the lookout for danger, and always ready to respond to your child's never-ending demands. One of the most challenging parts of being a parent is dealing with your kids' tantrums. You know what I'm talking about, those moments when your sweet little angel suddenly turns into a screaming, flailing demon. I remember the first time my daughter threw a tantrum in public. We were in the grocery store, and she wanted a candy bar. When I said no, she started screaming and crying, and I felt like every eye in the store was on me. But here's the thing, kids are like tiny little drunk people. They don't know what they want, and they don't know how to communicate it effectively. So when they throw a tantrum, it's not because they're trying to be difficult, it's because they're overwhelmed and frustrated. Another challenge of parenthood is trying to get your kids to eat healthy. I don't know about you, but my kids would happily eat nothing but chicken nuggets and mac and cheese if I let them. But as a responsible parent, I know I have to encourage them to eat their fruits and veggies. So what's my strategy? I tell them that if they eat their broccoli, they'll grow up to be big and strong like their favorite superheroes. And you know what? It works. My daughter is convinced that eating carrots will give her x-ray vision, and my son thinks that spinach will give him super strength. Hey, whatever works, right? But let's be real, parenting can be exhausting. Between the endless diaper changes, the sleepless nights, and the constant barrage of questions, it's easy to feel like you're running on fumes. That's why it's important to take some time for yourself every once in a while. I like to sneak off to the bathroom and lock the door for a few minutes of peace and quiet. It's like a mini spa day, but instead of cucumber slices on my eyes, I have a toddler banging on the door and demanding to know what I'm doing in there. In all seriousness, though, being a parent is one of the most rewarding things you can do. Watching your kids grow and learn is a joy like no other. And hey, if all else fails, you can always remind yourself that one day they'll be teenagers, and then you can return the favor by embarrassing them in public. Ah, parenting. It's the ultimate exercise in patience, perseverance, and pretending you know what you're doing. As someone who was not designed to handle the chaos of children, I have a lot of respect for those of you who have taken on the challenge. First off, let's talk about the sleep deprivation. It's like the military's enhanced interrogation technique, except instead of being waterboarded, you're being woken up every two hours by a tiny human who needs to be fed, changed, or just wants to see if you're still alive. And don't even get me started on the constant worry. Are they eating enough? Are they hitting their milestones? Are they going to grow up to be well-adjusted adults or become supervillains? The possibilities are endless. But it's not all bad. For one thing, kids are hilarious. They have no filter and will say the most unexpected things. My nephew once told me he wanted to be a ninja cat when he grew up. I'm not even sure what that means, but I'm fully supportive of his career aspirations. And then there are the joys of teaching them new things. Like the alphabet. It's so satisfying to watch their little faces light up when they finally get that elusive letter Q. And let's not forget the pure joy of watching them experience things for the first time. Seeing their eyes widen in wonder as they discover bubbles or ice cream is like getting a little glimpse into what it must feel like to be a kid again. But the real challenge of parenting is trying to balance all of the responsibilities that come with it. It's a constant juggling act of work, family, and personal time. And sometimes, in the midst of all the chaos, it can be easy to forget to take care of yourself. But trust me, it's important. Because as much as we love our little ankle biters, they can be exhausting. And if you don't take the time to recharge your own batteries, you'll be the one throwing a tantrum in the middle of the grocery store. In the end, being a parent is like riding a roller coaster blindfolded. You never know what's coming next, and it can be scary as hell. But at the end of the day, you're strapped in for the ride, and you wouldn't want it any other way. So to all the parents out there, keep on keeping on. And to all the non-parents, don't worry, your time will come. And when it does, just remember, sleep when the baby sleeps, and don't forget the wine. So, let's talk about being a parent and raising kids. Being a parent is a lot like being a superhero, except instead of a cape, you have a spit-up stained shirt and instead of saving the world, you're just trying to keep a tiny human alive. And if you're lucky, you might get a few hours of uninterrupted sleep in between diaper changes and feedings. One thing that always amazes me about being a parent is how quickly your priorities change. Suddenly, 
Things that used to be so important to you, like a night out with friends or binge watching your favorite show, take a backseat to nap schedules and playdates. And let's talk about those playdates for a second. As a parent, you suddenly find yourself thrust into this world of awkward small talk with other parents while your kids run around like maniacs. It's like being in a job interview, but instead of talking about your skills and qualifications, you're just trying to convince other parents that your kid isn't a complete disaster. But as challenging as parenting can be, it's also incredibly rewarding. There's nothing quite like seeing your child accomplish something for the first time, whether it's taking their first steps or saying their first words. And let's be honest, there's no better feeling than when your child tells you that you're the best parent in the world, even if they're just saying it because they want ice cream for breakfast. In conclusion, being a parent is a wild ride, full of ups and downs, but at the end of the day, it's all worth it for those sweet, sweet moments of joy and love. And if all else fails, just remember, wine and chocolate are always there for you at the end of a long day. Thank you, and good night. (laughs) And that wraps up another laughter-filled episode of Not So Funny A. If you enjoyed the jokes generated by our AI algorithms, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join our comedy-loving community.